Well, Oak Ridge National Labs is, uh, is probably one of the nation's treasures. Several thousand researchers uh, are, are making absolute uh, uh, strides, significant strides in a number of areas. One of those areas is building energy efficiency. And I think that uh, most of the American public does not know that we've got uh, a national research lab working on building energy efficiency, because energy efficiency is probably the major way that we can uh, address uh, climate change and energy independence. Thermal-proof windows quite simply save more energy than any other window, period, bar none. And uh, there's about eight different technologies involved in doing that, some, some real breakthroughs in, in space through technology, improvements in center of glass work, uh, improvements in the frame systems, uh, et cetera. But if you think about windows a little bit, uh, windows have been left behind. Uh, well, we've, well, we've improved the insulation in our walls from the, from the mid-70s on R3 or R4 all the way to R15, R16, R17 today. We've left windows back in the late 70s at basically an R2 to an R3 uh, with no further improvement. With high R value also comes uh, a comfort and, and people don't think much about comfort uh, uh, outwardly. We think of uh, R value as a specification and what does it mean? Of course it means uh, heat loss through a partitioner or, or through a window but, uh, and the higher the number the better. But more important to a lot of people is comfort. Uh, everyone knows that uh, even with dual pane windows, when they sit next to the window in the winter, in the Northeast, it's cold. So let's talk for a second about uh, net zero energy homes. Maybe many people don't realize that it is possible today to build uh, homes that uh, actually use no energy uh, net. Uh, and, and, and that's a result of, first of all, generating some energy on the roof with uh, solar, but it's also a result of significant improvements in, in insulation and in window systems and in door systems as well. You know, one of the critical uh, uh, steps in, uh, in the development of, of Thermaproof was to make sure that these windows could be affordable so that we could offer at least the R5s and the R7s for just about the same price or very little more than some premium R2 and R3 windows. Energy Star uh, for windows has been stuck at R2.8, uh, I suppose, for decades at this point, for, for a very long time. And uh, I think the public uh, would be surprised to know that Energy Star got stuck there. Well, it got stuck there because the industry is very uncomfortable with raising that bar to R5, R7, R9, R11. I'll tell you, the DOE has been wonderful. They have been trying to move this up to R7 and, and eventually R10 or R11 over some period of time. And uh, I think that uh, eventually they'll succeed. Uh, in spite of an industry that, uh, that doesn't want it to move, uh, we want it to move because we think it's important to save energy for this country. We think it's important to save energy for our clients. Over the 27 years that Sirius Materials has been making windows, high R value windows, and more recently Thermaproof, uh, we've saved some uh, 5 billion pounds of CO2 and uh, hundreds of millions of dollars of energy uh, bills for our customers uh, over dual panes. So we participated in two home retrofits for Oak Ridge National Labs. Uh, one was a Habitat for Humanity home, and the other one was for the uh, Tennessee Valley Authority. Both of these are focused on uh, net zero energy. In uh, one of them, we had to replace the existing windows. There have been windows in these highly monitored homes for, uh, for several years, and, um, and the windows from this other manufacturer were only in R2.8. Yes, they were dual pane low E, and yes, they're advertised every day as saving lots of energy, but what they mean is saving energy in comparison to a single pane window, not in comparison to other dual pane windows. Uh, so, uh, so we were able to replace those windows with uh, our, our R5 and R7 uh, product. And then in the, uh, in the brand new home for uh, Tennessee Valley Authority, we uh, put in a uh, new product that was all uh, approximately R7. Uh, and those are all uh, fully operable, fully modeled, and and, and fully tested in uh, third-party labs. So we're very confident that we've got, uh, in, in the case of the R7 windows, almost three times uh, the energy savings of virtually any other window on the market today. Well, we sent a team out to Tennessee uh, to install these windows, though any installer could have done it. We wanted to get them in, uh, in quick and, uh, and at the lowest cost, obviously. So we, we sent our team out there. Uh, and, and in one of the homes, uh, we took our 2.8 to R7. And, uh, and we had to replace the, uh, the windows that were there. Um, in the other home, it was a brand new installation. Uh, Wade West uh, uh, led the team out in Tennessee, uh, and he uh, has uh, many, many years' experience as an AMA certified uh, window installer. So, um, you know, he put these in as any uh, trained installer would do for windows. 
and uh, it was a very successful uh, install. Uh, right now, uh, they've been in for about a month, and uh, and uh, the uh, DOE and the uh, uh, Oak Ridge National Labs are monitoring these homes uh, to see uh, how much energy is saved. Uh, the models show that uh, this is going to be significant energy saving in these homes in comparison to what dual pane Loewe would have been because the homes are already pretty well buttoned up. So uh, in these homes, the windows by far were, uh, were the last biggest leak uh, uh, when they were just dual pane Loewe. So switching to an R5 and R7, uh, these, are, these are big changes uh, for those homes. Uh, so great lesson for homeowners here uh, uh, that uh, this is good enough for um, U.S. government to put into these uh, to these uh, net zero energy homes, and 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 their focus is for affordability in these homes. Then I think those are those are great proof points for you to also consider, uh, uh, for the you know the, the listeners or the watchers of this video to consider uh, thermal proof windows as well.